Skilled researchers will make sure to critically analyze every source they use. Do not always take the information you find at face value. Just because something is a primary source, or is old or original, it is not guaranteed to be true or factual. Always question your sources, considering the author or creator and the intended audience, and also what information is present and what is missing. Asking questions like, who created this record? And what were the circumstances surrounding its creation? That can help you establish a context for understanding the environment in which the source was created. Some questions you may want to ask while working with primary sources include, what type of resources are you using? Who authored or created it and why might they have created it? When was it created? What was going on at the time? Who was the intended audience? What evidence does the resource provide and what is missing? Is there information you would expect that isn't there? Where else might you find that information? What are the strengths and weaknesses of the resources as evidence? What conclusions or speculations can you make? How might you continue your research? What are your next steps? It's important to keep in mind that doing research in archives and special collections tends to be more complex and time-consuming than other kinds of research. Our collections do not circulate outside of the archives and special collections, meaning you will not be able to take things home. So you will want to allow plenty of time to go through and analyze the sources you found on site. Contact archives and special collections ahead of time to ensure the availability of requested material. When you find useful information, make sure to write it down where you found it so you can refer to it and cite it later and follow up with additional research if necessary. Be aware that you might not always find all the answers you are hoping to find and make sure to consider where else you might go to find additional information. Since archives and special collections work with rare and one-of-a-kind materials, Please be aware that there are some specific rules we'll ask you to observe when you visit. For example, you'll be asked to sign in on a visitor's register and stash bags, food, and drink before entering your research spaces. These guidelines, as well as research hours and parking information, may vary depending on the program and facility. Before visiting archives and special collections, you should contact staff for details. Heritage Resources has these and other guidelines listed on our website. While our job is partly to preserve rare, original, and historical materials, we are equally responsible for making sure those resources are accessible to our patrons. We want researchers to have a productive and meaningful experience when they visit our facilities. Staff at Heritage Resources typically know the collections very well, and can help researchers narrow their topics and find primary sources that are relevant to their research. Ultimately, we are here to help, so please feel free to ask lots of questions and share lots of information about what it is you're trying to find out. Contact us at heritage.resources at www.edu or call 360-650-7534 to get started exploring the wonderful world of primary sources and the archives and special collections at Western. Please leave a voicemail if no one is available.